In this video, we'll be covering the different filtering options within UpContent. There are numerous sorting options and filters within the UpContent platform, some exclusively for topics or collections, and some that are shared between both. Ones that are shared between both will be the type filter. You can have all, news, blog, other, or all including other. We're going to skip the sort feature for the time being because that will be different between the topics and collections. You have the publish feature, which will show you the dates that these articles were published and you can say if i only want to see the last seven days of articles that were published you go ahead and select week you can input up to a year or you can stick with the default at two months you have your sources drop down your sources drop down will allow you to select the sources you would like to view in your topics and collections if you uncheck a source it will remove it from the view if you click on the number that is associated with that source it will only show you that specific source you also have the ability to include new sources here, which you can go ahead and uncheck or keep checked if you want to see new sources in your topics and collections that flow through. And then you have the ability to filter the sources as well as select all sources simply by clicking the all button right here as well. Lastly, for the shared sources, we have the show filter. You have show favorites only. Show favorites only means that we're only going to show the articles that you have favorited or as we call it, starred exclude paywall content this will go ahead and exclude any content that is locked behind a paywall that includes articles from publications such as the new york times forbes or hbr where there is a paywall subscription required to view those articles there are some paywall publications such as forbes that allow you to have a certain number of viewable articles a day that you can go ahead and still see via the exclude paywall content filter the has image filter that will exclude any articles that do not have an image associated with it. That image being presented is subject to the publisher. You can always assign an image within your collection as well to be associated with an article and then exclude thin content. Exclude thin content will go ahead and remove any content that is less than a specified character limit that up content has assigned to the accounts. So we will not see anything from an publication that does not meet the minimum character limit requirement. For the difference between topics and collections, we're going to be looking at the sort filter. Sort in topics, we have relevance, which will show us how the content is ranked upon how accurately it matches your keywords within your topic. Recency, that means that any article that floats to the top here was the most recently published article by that publisher. Shareability, Shareability means that it is a proprietary score that we assign to content based on its propensity to be shared within UpContent. Core factors include the presence or absence of an image on the page and presence of certain words in the title and body of the content that research has linked to higher click rates. Lastly, we have influence here. Influence is a measure of an article's ability to drive other content to reference it. We measure influence by defining a network of all of the links in your result set. This helps us determine which articles are the center of a particular conversation, helping you find the sources of that that are leading the discussion. Looking at your collection, the list of sort features for the collections are recency. Same as your topic, it'll show you the most recently curated article. Shareability, as mentioned before, displays the content in order of how likely your audience is to engage with the article. Influence displays the content in order of the most influential source, similar to your topics. Added is solely for your collection. That means it's going to sort the content based upon how it was added to the collection. Updated will sort the content based upon the most recently updated articles. This means that you can either leave a note on an article, favorite an article, change an article's image, change an article's title, anything that would adjust the way that the article is appearing in your collection would then bump it to the top of the updated rank, and then smart. Smart displays content in order of an article's predicted performance compared to other articles within the collection, as well as the account. If you have any questions about up content, please give us a call at 412-447-1773 or shoot us an email at info at upcontent.com.